So let's find 7 tenths of an inch on this ruler or tape measure. And this is our traditional ruler or tape measure with the fractional divisions here. So 7 divided by 10, that's 0 0.7 as a decimal. So that's what we're going to be looking for. Before we do this, though, you can get rulers that are divided into tenths of an inch. So right here we have 1, 2, 3. Right here is 7 tenths of an inch. So it ends up being a about maybe a little past right here on our ruler or tape measure. So with this, you can find it immediately. So if you work in tenths of an inch a lot, real helpful. Even does hundreds. Link in the description if you need one of those. But let's figure it out for this traditional ruler or tape measure here. So 0 0.7. So I've converted the fractions here to decimals. One half is 0 0.5, and then we have 0.75. So we're close to 3 fourths of an inch, not quite there. Um, 5 eighths of an inch, this one here, 0 0.625. So it looks like we're going to be right about in this area right here. So let's figure out what this is here. We have 1 16th, 2, 3, 9, 10, 11. This is 11 16ths of an inch. If you convert that to a decimal, you get 0 0.6875, pretty close. So I would say we're right about here on our ruler or tape measure, just a little bit past this 11 16th of an inch. That's where you're going to find 7 tenths of an inch. That's how you do it. This is Dr. B and thanks for watching.